We want to take the opportunity to again apologise to the Morgan family for the failure of the Metro Police to bring anyone to justice so far for that murder. And I recognise that that failure has only added to their pain and anguish over these 34 years, and for that I unreservedly apologise. To your question of institutional corruption, it's a very damning phrase, and clearly we need to take this very, very seriously. The report's only been published for a couple of hours, as you know, and it's a very detailed and complex report. So I want to make sure that I fully understand what that term is defined as in the report and also the evidence upon which uh, that assertion is made. But my gut reaction to the concept that the Metropolitan Police Service is institutionally corrupt is, is one that I can only judge through my own lived experience, if you like. I don't think, however, in my experience anyway, and of course I do need to read the report, I don't see that that adds up to a concept of institutional corruption. It isn't what I see every day now and it isn't my, my, my experience over 31 years. I think the Commissioner is in the best position, once we've been able to reflect on the recommendation of this report, to take this organisation where it needs to go next to deal with the recommendations.